Hey YouTube, what's up? Um, this is going to be a really weird video on how I'm taking it because I, yet again I'm still using my webcam. But, um, I am using... I am sending my own baits right now. I am trying this and I don't know how it's going to work. But I've been fishing lately, haven't had any good luck. But I got some some of these weird worms I got from Tackle Junkie in here scented, getting scented. I have Sankos in here that... Uh, Agreeing with Red Flake. Uh, hold on, I got the package right here. Um, it is black and red watermelon, and then I had just have some of these regular speed tail worms. Um, what I did to do my caffeine scent, as you see, is I got a bowl here. It's just full of coffee and coffee grounds ish. I just took the part of my coffee. Well, of my dad's coffee maker, this part right here, and I just used his old coffee grounds instead of wasting, you know, because it still has coffee and whatnot in there, so you can just use that, but yeah, uh, so far, I've had them in here for about a half hour, wow, it smells like coffee, uh, sorry if I sound a little plugged up, though, I am just now trying to get over a head cold that I've had for about four days now, but... Anyways, yeah, I'm just sitting here scenting my own baits. I'm going to let this probably sit a good two days in this bowl. I'm going to let all these sit two days, and then I'm going to put them all back in the original package with a little bit of coffee grounds in here to make my own caffeine scent on my baits. So I mean, they might work that way, but I'm just doing some random ones that I don't use much, except for the Sankos. I love the Sankos, even though I've yet to catch a fish on them. I only have four of those left. I keep tearing them, so I'm gonna have to get something to like mend it back together or something, because there's times when I go to cast, I think I'm casting too hard and they just rip. But yeah, anyways, I just want to keep you guys uh, up to date on what I'm doing. I'm sorry it's been forever since I've made a video. I've been, like I said, I'm just now getting over a head cold. As you can tell, I still got the sniffles and whatnot. Um, I also went up to Northern Michigan, my girlfriend's college. She's up there, she's... I, hope she's enjoying herself. I don't see why she wouldn't be. But yeah, she's got off to college now, so now it's pretty much me trying to find spots where I can go around and fish pretty much by myself. But I also have a buddy who fishes with me, and he's like the main guy that fishes with me. So yeah, it's pretty cool. I will be going, hopefully either, I'm hoping tomorrow after I clean my room and whatnot, because... I found out this new place I want to try. It's got pike and all that in there, but I really want to try these. So I might take these. I might not. I just might keep these in here fermenting for a while. Well, not fermenting, but scenting. And I got one that keeps floating. I don't like it floating. Get down to the bottom. All the other baits sank except for this one. But these are pretty cool. These are good for, like, drop shot or whatever you want to call them. You can sit there and float. But, yeah, um... Anyways, oh yeah, I would also like to tell you guys that you guys need to check out, give me a second to go to YouTube real quick on my computer, I was looking up stuff real quick, what's his name? He's new, Tackle Junkie, just got him into YouTubing, or doing YouTube videos, his name is Fishing Francie, Frenchy, my bad, Fishing Frenchy 33 he just came out with, I think it was either today or yesterday, he just came out with... No, seven hours ago, he just made his last, or no, his first YouTube video. So I'm going to leave his channel link in the description of this video. So you guys go check him out. He's new. Just tell him that I sent you guys. I'm just doing this because I want to help out people who are new to YouTube. I'm up to 145 YouTube subscribers. I don't know how. One of my videos is almost 6,000 views. It's at that. It's at the half point of 6,000 views. I remember being back in the day when I only had, like, four views on a video. And that was it. But uh, thanks to you guys on everything. Thanks to TackleJunkie81 for all the baits he sent out. Um, I am really I really don't know what happened to Philly Basson. But I'm still grateful to, from him for sending me out the reel that he sent me. I know it's been a while, but I'm still... I still love the fact that I can go out and use this stuff, and I am still really thankful and always going to be grateful for what 
they have done for me. Everybody that helped pitch in, thank you very much. There was Extreme Bass Fisher. Extreme Bass Fisherman, I believe his name was. Uh, yes. He helped. He sent out some stuff. I thank him a lot. I'm still, I still text him here and there. He's a really cool guy. I lost his number. So, yeah. But anyways, uh, I'd like to say thank you guys very much on everything. And I will keep you posted on how these baits go. So, yeah. Uh, have a good day. Uh, hopefully I get over this head cold, and thank you very much, and please like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good night.